perennial philosophy to world religion as a context for our diversity in response to the meta crisis. I am Christina Tehel. Here I recapitulate pivotal sections of first principles in direct quotes from Dr. Mark Goffney or Barbara Marks Hubbard, woven together from the prior week's One Mountain, Many Paths broadcast. We will not succeed in engaging the meta crisis of existential and catastrophic risk without articulating a shared world philosophy, world spirituality, world religion as a ground for our diversity. The perennial philosophy, the shared truths of the great traditions is a very important dimension of reality. Last Sunday was the Hebrew New Year called Rosh Hashanah. Last Sunday, we engaged in such a world historical process. In history, we've moved between names of God that actually don't validate our inner knowing about the nature of reality and don't validate the deepest realizations about reality in an integrated synergistic form. Descriptions of the divine are non-personal, don't actually reach or feel our lives, the depth of our humanity, or the depth of love and kindness and goodness. It's an infinity, but it's an abstract infinity. It's an infinity of indifference. Remember what we always say, the God you don't believe in doesn't exist. God is either too infinite but becomes an infinity of indifference or God is too concretized too intimate and it becomes an intimacy of impotence and as we move towards the construction not just of a world spirituality but of a world religion a world religion which is not dominating which is committed to manifesting a world that works for everyone, and that is a context for our diversity, we realize that we are all part of something that's greater than the sum of the individuated parts. We realize that there is a God and that that God is the infinite intimate and that new whole is the world religion that's rooted in a universal grammar of value, rooted in first principles and first values that are embedded in a story of value, the story of us going somewhere. We move from mud to Mozart, from bacteria to Bach. We move from quarks to culture. That's who we are. We are unique incarnations of cosmic value, not as a fantasy, but as the most fantastic reality that you can possibly imagine. Not accidentally, but filled with contingency, filled with surprise, filled with spontaneity, with an overarching arc of non-randomness manifesting as the good, the true and the beautiful, manifesting as value, seeking, desiring ever more value. What a delight it is to be here and to be weaving and participating together in evolving the very source code of reality itself, to proclaim and to declare a new name of God, for world religion, to call out the name of God as the infinite intimate. Every human being is an irreducibly unique incarnation of the infinite intimate. Every human being is an infinite unique incarnation, a unique configuration of intimacy and desire that never was, is, or will be ever again. Every human being participates in the name of God. <laughs>